Hey what's happening guys, Carl here from ElitePromoter.com and in this video we're going to be looking at ManyChat. So ManyChat is a Facebook instant messenger bot that allows you to automate a conversation between your business page and your potential customer and it also lets you build up a subscriber list of Facebook users. Now the advantage of using ManyChat to build a subscriber list is that it boasts a 100% delivery rate meaning that every message that you send through Facebook is going to be seen by your audience. Now when you compare that to email marketing, where open rates have been on the decline in recent years, you can definitely see why tools like ManyChat are starting to get really popular. So let's jump into ManyChat now and I'm going to show you how this thing works and also give you a demonstration of it running on the Elite Promoter homepage. Okay so we're in the ManyChat dashboard now and the sign up process is really straightforward. You just need to connect your Facebook business page to ManyChat and it literally just takes a few clicks of the mouse and you'll be able to do this. And you'll see here I've got two subscribers. This is myself and my wife currently and this was just a test that this bot actually works before I start testing on the general public. And the first thing you're going to need to do is head over to the growth tool section and you're going to click on new growth tool. So this is what you're presented with. Basically you've got overlay widgets. Now the best way to explain this is if you've ever done captured any emails then you'll be using most likely you'll be using a pop-up to do this on your website and this is exactly what this part this section here is. So you've got different styles of pop-ups. You've got a center window, a page takeover, a slide in or you've just got a top bar that's shown at the top of your website and if you don't have a website let's say you've got a YouTube channel and you want to let people know your latest video you can use a self-hosted landing page by ManyChat and just let people know as soon as you've done a new video and people are going to get that delivered straight to their instant messenger so there's, there's two options most businesses are going to be using the overlay widget and we're going to be using in this example we're going to be using modal I'll select that and you just want to give it a name at the top so we'll go for EP pop-up and this is the preview of what your pop-up is going to look like so you've got your headline here your copy and your call to action and we'll start with the headline first you can just click on this and edit it so I'm just going to make one up here let me give you a guide to help with your campaigns And we can disable this if you don't need that, the description box here, we just click this little tab here and that will get rid of that. Um, or you can just write something like, hit the button below to get your free guide. If you want to change the call to action here, you're going to have to select with checkbox that'll let you do that. This just means that people have to click a little box to subscribe to this and we can just change that get my freebie and we can also add an image in this part you've got a little section here drop an image to upload so we can put something suitable in there and you can change where this image is placed so we can say above the description or above below the description wherever you wherever you feel comfortable I'm going to leave it just like that and we can show when this will actually display when this pop-up will actually trigger on your website so we've got a percentage of scrolled so you could go for like 80% so when when somebody gets to the bottom of your landing page this is going to pop up and you've got you can display it immediately or when they go to X off the page I've, I've tried that it doesn't seem to be very quick so I probably wouldn't recommend that one um, it seems to take a while for this to, to actually pop up on a landing page when you try and close the page down so I would go for either seconds of past so you could say like 20, 20 seconds of past or when you get to a certain um, reach on the page you can also alter the frequency when this is shown to people so the same widget to the same user you could show straight uh, uh, on another day or never again or every so every uh, three hours or something whatever you want you can really knock yourself out here and uh, choose the situation that's 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 relevant to you um, you can also change the 
background colors of the headline so we can have like a red headline or green headline if you want to match your website colors but I would probably leave the button blue because this is related to Facebook if it's people are going to know this is kind of going to open up Facebook in a second so I'd leave it like that and then we just go to the submitted state so this is our pop-up now done the submitted state is when they've actually opted in so we can say thank you head over to Facebook Messenger to get your guide and we can disable this description for a second you can leave that as view it in messenger if you want or open up FB messenger and again you can change the background here to suit the colors of your website or the headline and you can add an image again as we did before but we're just going to go straight to opt-in actions and this is what users are going to see once they've opted in so this is a welcome message and this will be directly within Facebook either on their phone or on the desktop and you've got here welcome first name you can click this and you can change the variable so you can put the full name in there this just grabs this from Facebook and you can just write a quick welcome message here if you want so I'm going to leave this if you want to unsubscribe just type stop and you can add here um, choose choose which guide will help you the most I go one native headline formulas these are these are guides that I give um, to give people a sneak preview of the type of content that's available on, on elitepromoter.com so these are sort of lead magnets if you will I can go SEO guide, Facebook images guide and the idea here is just to let the user decide which is more valuable to them. So type one, two or three below to get your guide. Now what we need to do now is save this and we need to go to the automation section and you've got keywords and this is going to basically display certain content depending on what they actually write as a reply so if we go to keywords and we we've already there's already a few in here so messages start or subscribe and they subscribe and if they type in stop then it'll unsubscribe from the bot we're going to add a new rule here that says if they enter one then we can create a reply now one was the native guy so we can say thanks here is your native headline formula guide and you can either put a URL to um, a Google Docs or you can actually add the file here if we click file then you can select your PDF to to give somebody there if you've got a lead magnet um, but I'm just going to leave this as an, as an example at the moment just to show you how this works so we're going to click save on that and we're going to go back to keywords and we're going to add a new rule which is two create keyword create reply thanks here is your SEO guide save that back to keywords the last one if they type in number three Great keyword. Thanks. Here is your Facebook guide. And again, we just add the link there or the PDF to finish that. So that's all we need to do there. If we go back to the growth tools and we edit this pop up. Okay, so opt in actions. So that should automatically trigger now depending on what they type in so you could now set this up so what you need to do is click on install Java snippet and you will just need to add this into your you'll have to add your website first and then it will give you the code to copy to the clipboard you just need to add that in the head section of your website 
for this to actually trigger. And once you've set that up, you just need to select this as active. So I'm going to come back in a sec and show you what this looks like. OK, I've installed the JavaScript to the Elite Promoter website and we're going to make this thing pop. So we're just going to scroll down. Pop, 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 hopefully. Yep. Click on the call to action. Open in Facebook Messenger. And my phone's just gone then just to tell me that this message has come through Instant Messenger. And here's the message that we wrote earlier. So we just need to choose one, two or three. So type in one. And there we go. Thanks for your thanks. Here is your native headline formula guide. Now remember, we didn't add a link at that point. We could have dropped a PDF file in there, which they could have um, clicked on and instantly got. We'll just try it with the other number two. There's your SEO guide, number three. Here's your Facebook guide. So you can see how powerful this is. But I want to show you one other thing as well. If we head back to ManyChat. Now, so far, we've looked at very basic automation. We're going to take it a little bit further now. And if you head back to the automation section and click on your keywords, we can apply an action uh, to whichever one of these they select. And this can be adding a tag, which will basically group that particular audience together. So if we ever want to send a broadcast later on, we can just send a broadcast to people that have signed up to get guide number one or guide number two. It's simple to do. We just need to select add a tag, enter a new tag here. So I'll just put native, for instance, add tag. The tag's been created. Message to those guys with people wanting an SEO guide. So I could tag them as SEO people. And lastly, Facebook people. And sorry, is that done? That's done. OK, so they've all got that action now. So. What you can do then is what if I ever want to um, follow up and set a broadcast, you go to engage broadcast, select new broadcast and you could put whatever you want here. If you've got, you know, my guys, I give video training on how to run native. So if I've got a new video that teaches people a new tactic, I could just add a quick video here, a quick link to the video. And basically in the settings, I would just click on the targeting and you've got this condition box here and I can just um, do it by tag and guys that are native okay so anybody that's signed up um, for number one for the guide number one will just get this broadcast and you can check on your targeting if you head over to the audience section you've got your tag section here on the right hand side at the moment obviously this isn't live but as your subscribers come in and, and select which guide they want, you would get the, these would count up. So you'd start to see what exactly what audience you've got. So it's really, really useful that. Uh, the other thing you can do as well, um, if we head back to the automation section, is you can click on sequences here. And this is just like an autoresponder for email. You can set up a sequence. So I've just there's an example here. You can just click new sequence, native, and you can set the delay of when these will be sent after the user first subscribes and these are all completely editable it just gives you like hints on on what to write so it says here remind your subscriber who you are and why they're getting messages from you deliver valuable information and tell people that they can unsubscribe if they want to and if we go back to the keyword section we've already set up this tag but we can add another action as well to subscribe to that sequence that we've just made there. So you can see how powerful this is. There really is a lot of options and um, you can make this fully automated. One other thing is if we head over to the live chat, we can see there was me earlier and I selected the various different guides. I can reach out to this to this user. I can reach out to myself whenever I want and um, just give further help if needed and really have a one-to-one -one conversation with your potential uh, customer which is, is which is what it's all about you know elite promoter I want to help people get past the sticking point and if I can do that through instant messenger then they're going to benefit from that and I'm going to benefit when they decide to take me up on on joining the forum so many chat looks really really good I'm definitely going to be giving this one a test and I know this isn't a super in-depth tutorial here because I've only just got this myself but I can really see the um, the potential for this already.
So I hope you find this video beneficial. Um, let me know if you did in the comments. Subscribe to Elite Promoter for more tutorials like this one. And consider joining us if you're an affiliate or you're an entrepreneur, then this is the place for you. We talk about all the best growth strategies and campaign hacks and tips and tricks to get more from your advertising. Thanks for watching and see you on a video soon.